This is Brenda. She's a cleaner at St Mary's. She's here to tell us a bit about her day. Um, I get up at five o'clock in the morning and um, I leave my house about ten to six to get here for six o'clock and we start work at six o'clock. The cleaners do from six o'clock to eight thirty and then they come back for three thirty while five thirty. Your first job really is to get all your rubbish out. That's out of the classrooms and um, toilet areas, you know, whatever area you're cleaning. You sweep your corridors, then you set to and you hoover. Toilets are a priority and they must be cleaned on the night time. You've got um, tables to wash, all the desks to wash, wipe down chairs. You do some cleaning jobs daily and others like paint work, doors, door frames, you do once a week. You have door windows to do, you have floors to polish, wash, you know, if need be. Right, and out of term time, well it's, you know, it's, I'm not saying it's a different job, but you have more jobs to do, you know, um, like trying to get the chewing gum off the tables. The chewing gum, I just think it's disgusting, you know, and um, there's the germs, you know, when you, pe when you think people have had it in the mouth and they've pulled it out of the mouth and there's all their saliva on it, you know, and then they're sticking it under the, um, the desk. And, I mean, we put our rubber gloves on and um, otherwise I wouldn't touch it, you know, without rubber gloves on. So I really do think it's disgusting. Chewing gum. Minty or fruity, it makes extra work for the cleaners. We are joined by Mr Nicholson, the behavioural manager at St Mary's. Here is what he had to say about the cleaners and the chewy. We've got a smashing team of cleaners here that work extremely hard. They do a really good job for our school. When I arrive in the morning, every morning, the school is nice and clean and tidy. It smells nice and they've been working extremely hard to keep it that way. And they do a fantastic job in the work. Very, very hard. The, the, the problem with chewing gum is, is the way the pupils dispose of it. Instead of keeping the silver paper, putting the silver paper and putting it into the litter bin, they don't. They spit it anywhere, on the floor, they put it under desks. It means the cleaners have to work exceptionally hard to keep the place tidy and clean. And chewing gum is horrendous to get off the floor. We caught up with the head of Year 7, Mrs Wilbar, to find out about the policy of St Mary's on chewing gum. St so Mary's policy on chewing gum is that it's not allowed anywhere on the school site. The cleaners in our school are absolutely excellent, they're lovely people, we all know them by their first names and they do a superb job, but it is not their job to be cleaning chewing gum off floors. I think it's revolting, it's not fair on other people, because your classroom is used not just by you and your phone group, but by numerous, hundreds in fact, of other students in the school, and nobody should have to suffer that when they're sitting behind a desk trying to learn. Unfortunately, people seem to think it's acceptable, or used to think it was acceptable, before it was entirely banned on the school sites, to stick it onto radiators and walls and so on, and as teachers we move around this site an awful lot and it can end up stuck on your clothes, which is very difficult to remove. Likewise, if it's underneath desks, it'll be difficult to get off your own school trousers, so your parents won't be very pleased. So, chewing gum, it gets stuck on clothes, under desks and everywhere imaginable. Is this the environment you want to work in? Mrs Wilbar had one last message to the students. Never to chew it in this school and do your best not to chew it outside school either because it really doesn't look very nice. From bins to graffiti and from chewy to rubbish, cleaners keep the school clean and tidy for you to enjoy, even if you were the ones making the mess. Dressed in all of me Stretched across my shame All the torment and the pain Leaked through